G'day all. I just wanted to let you know a bit more about the Australian Seasonal Bushfire Outlook that was released in Melbourne yesterday. The Outlook is developed by the Bushfire Natural Hazards Cooperative Research Centre with the Bureau of Meteorology and relevant state fire and land managers, including us here at CFA. It gives us an early indication of what Victoria could expect this bushfire season. Like last year, the outlook indicates that much of Victoria will have a normal fire season. But as you know, even a normal season means we will have significant fires. In East Gippsland, conditions could make for an above average fire season and there's also a growing risk north of the divide extending into southeastern New South Wales. It's now the third year in a row that these areas have experienced less than average rainfall, which means the soil and the heavy forest fuels are very, very dry. There is also a lot of dead fuel around and more flammable live vegetation. Recent winter rainfall means we'll have greater growth in pastures and croplands in the west. So we know a lot of our people will be busy harvesting those crops and working with their communities to avoid fires caused by machinery and self-combusting haystacks. The Bureau of Meteorology predicts a warm and dry outlook, which brings some risks that ash forests in the central highlands and the Otways may dry out at a faster rate and become more flammable than normal during the summer. To manage the fire risk in Gippsland, while we have demands on our people in the west and the northwest during the harvesting season, we are looking to draw on our valuable volunteer members on the Metropolitan Fringe and other areas for any strike teams that we may need.